hello friends welcome to the second video of this course which is called syllabus it is presented by me that is Aryum Padel so what's the syllabus of NEET or AIMS or any other pre-medical examination you know it is NCRT 11th and 12th and mostly by most of us by more than 90% of us it is misunderstood we just consider that the syllabus is only those 350 pages of 11th NCRT and the same number of pages of 12th NCRT. Just that much. But we don't know how to read the NCRT book properly. So syllabus is 11th and 12th NCRT if NCRT is read properly. And what are the topics in the syllabus? There, are, there is taxonomy which deals about the classification of the different life forms into in the hierarchical classification um, presented by IRH Whitaker, then anatomy of plants and the morphology of animals and plants also, then plant and animal physiology will be discussing, then reproduction, genetics, biotech and ecology. Among these topics, what list all topics are simple, this ecology. This is very very simple. Why? Because most of us have been studying ecology since 6th or 5th standard. First in the environmental sciences, the EVS book that used to come. Then in the, uh, I mean, there was another EVS book in our school that used to be, I don't know if it was in other schools also. Uh, in that book we used to read and also the geography book. It is also a good source of ecology. So we have been dealing with ecology since long. So it is going to be a very simple topic and it is very, very important for NEET and also for AIMS. Many questions come from this topic. Okay, then reproduction. It is a big topic, plant reproduction, animal reproduction and general reproduction. So this is also an important topic, an easy topic. I mean, most of the biology is easy. If you study it properly, if you give it proper time, you know what we think is that biology is an easy subject we just have to memorize things so we can just give it a small small time it's we just give it a little time and in the end we regret that why didn't we give some time to biology okay so please devote your time so how to get started means how should we start studying biology first of all the very first tip is that start start studying biology from the origin itself from the starting because everything which is there in the ncrt book it is arranged in a very peculiar very much you know uh, hierarchical manner that first of all there is classification so that you will know about the life forms from the microorganisms to we human beings that how will how are we created and all everything you'll read about this that, 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 that organism okay then you'll read about anatomy of plants and animals and morphology then you'll come to the reproduction uh, sorry uh, to the physiology just imagine if you just directly go to physiology and then read the uh, basic design of plants and animals and what that is your mistake that you'll have to uh, you'll have to memorize many things in, phys uh, in physiology so please go sequence wise don't jump from topic to topic okay then start from the origin itself keep everything clear keep all your basics clear because if your basics are not clear then it will be going to be problematic for you that is uh, the basics about the tissues the cell you know, just study from the basic first of all study about the cell what is cell cell organelles everything about cell cell division and all i forgot to mention the topic cell and cell division in this so please remember that also then keep a positive attitude if you are an average student or a below average student then don't worry biology is very very easy you can easily score 330 plus marks in NEET and 50 plus in AIMS just by studying regularly just study regularly and always ask the doubts don't leave everything anything uncleared clear each and everything before you just close it up okay thank you